So last week, the three of us flew to LA to take part in the all hands meeting where we met with the rest of our larger overarching research group. Hi, Andrea. I'm making a video for you even though you're right next to me. I'm reading this book and I'm on the first page. This is the first paragraph. The invigorating objectivity of true contemplation is something which a man of my temperament cannot achieve in unfamiliar town in England even when he has not been worrying about trains. Trains <laughs> are bad for the nerves at the best of times. What did people have nightmares about before there were trains? <laughs> so now we're recording. And yeah, you're on camera. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we're just gonna make a monosphere. So like it's your first video, and you don't train me to hold it, and it's, it shoots spherically. So down, up, everything. 360, yeah. actually that's more than 360 because Oh, is that here? 360? Yeah. Are we vlogging? Yes, we are vlogging. Hey, what up? Hi. It's because this car is so gorgeous and I want to capture it for all the beauty. It's only 30 seconds, but we're very low res, so it's okay. <laughs> I know nothing about this technology, so I can't I have even... one in my bag. It's a spherical camera. Oh, okay. 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 Why, why you get really? only... You get dueling phase. Yeah. <laughs> Mine is white. <gasps> Mine is blue. Fives is yellow. Andres is pink. Oh, that is oh, why <laughs> did she walk instead of taking this car with us? How many famous can we get in one car at one time? <laughs> For those who don't know, that's Ken and this is Amelia. That's right. This is certainly the most high tech technology that has ever been in this video. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Score! Where is it? Where is it? Oh, do I have it? Do I have it? Maybe I left it home. Oh! It's so funny. Yeah. It's more of us. Eureka Theta. I love the Rico Theta. Although if you hold one at right angles to all the others, shouldn't it be called the, the Rico oh. Phi? <laughs> that is a groaner, sir. That is a there groaner. You hey! There you go. There you go. All of the Thetas are happening. Yeah, there you go. There. Ken went with the white apple style one. That's mm -hmm. right. I, you know, the reason I got that one, and I even got this color of this thing, and I thought it had to match. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, I had to do the whole kind of, you know, Bjork video from 2002 kind of thing. <laughs> Ta-da! Ta-da! Fire trucks! All of the siren or lights or something is happening. A couple people are okay. I mean, it's too dark to see that we have all four colors. <laughs> but we do. We're, We're like the Power four Rangers four of spherical video. We have all four colors. Yes! <laughs> This is Alan Kay's organ, and one of his hobbies is to put classical pianists on the organ and be amused by them discovering that they can poke notes with their feet. This was just following an amazing early music concert that he was kind enough to arrange for us.
There's a pencil in the organ. <laughs> I don't know if this is like integral to its operation or. <laughs> no, probably the, the whole thing. Thing. The board is always going where you're looking. But that button's always forward. Here we're playing so with something that Andrea really set up using the Makey Makey, it which basically yeah. turns capacitive input into uh, keyboard in controls. Around. So it's hooked up to one of our virtual reality uh, yeah, uh, web VR yeah. things. So she put aluminum foil on the ground, and different sections of the aluminum foil are connected to different keyboard input, with the middle being ground. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to convert my shoes into VR shoes. <laughs> so to get electrons to move through you, you need to take off your shoes. Or you could ground your shoes, which is what I decided to do with copper foil tape. I right, Andre, check this out. It will connect my skin. To... I would suggest that you also follow this part because you probably intuitively tap over here. I guess you've both already run into this several times, but this was the first time I really felt like I had accidentally captured something with a spherical camera that I hadn't meant to capture, and then had the pleasure of watching it afterwards, which is when I was busy foiling my shoes. And then Emily, you and Ken were having this amazing conversation. Oh, I completely agree. That was just one demo. For example, one thing that we did that I didn't show was if two people and one shrinks down to be six inches high and they're standing on the table. And then when I'm six inches high and I look around, the room is huge and the other people are giants and the table is really big. And then the other people, person looks down, and they see me on the table, and they can actually move the table, and I see the table. Yeah, and it works out. And, yeah. and uh, I'm just told you that the socks are thin enough to actually one get person is standing like this, but and the other person works on the other room, and they're like next to each other, room, yeah, but they yeah. think they're in these spaces. Yeah, I and or else you're gonna have to get And then yeah. there's this really non-obvious stuff that happens, yeah. which is if I'm six inches tall, right, let me see if this works. And I'm in this room. I'll do the other one and then see if. So that it sounds to me like a giant space. It looks like air. And that is kind of crazy because kind of what I'm saying is that in my subjective reality, sound actually goes very slower. So I mean it's like physics has changed because I'm small. And then yeah. some of the table, you kind of want to take out all the bass from the voice. Yeah, like so excited. I know, right? Because when you, I mean, you don't even know until you try it. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Let's make room. Yes. Yes. It's gonna be awesome. Um. Oh, I don't know where we are. So thanks, Ken, for letting me use this footage and generally being awesome. Wanna try that? Uh huh. Yep. Yeah, right. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we're going. <laughs> okay. I'll do the other one up then. <laughs> oh, I have a controller. <laughs> So, did you make the cake conductive to your body? Oh, I see, yes. So, you can trigger it. Yeah, you can like oh, trigger it. That's like awesome. a yeah. This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're going to start open and go up our four chords. closed off from the world or isolated and it's good to remember there's other people out there doing cool things and the rest of our group exists and see friends who I haven't seen in a while.
But more than any of that, it reminded how much I love working with the two of you. And now I feel all ready and excited to have our new intern starting and pay forward some of the awesomeness we've benefited from hanging out with such a cool crowd. We're making DeLorean jokes. Are we vlogging? Yes, we are vlogging. Hey, what up? V. What up, Ace? V. Ace. Ace. Hey. Hey, hey. We're about to watch a concert. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, making dirty DeLorean jokes. You know what's up? Sparkling water up in here. Sparkling water. Thank you.